we were interested in uh, examining one of the most important evolutionary events in our history as animals, which is the transition from animals living in water to living on land. When the first land animals began moving on mud and sand 360 million years ago, their powerful tails may have been more important than scientists previously thought. That's one conclusion from a new study published in the journal Science. The researchers use robotics, mathematical models, in several live mudskipper fish to explore movement under different types of conditions as the animals climb ashore. The mudskipper fish provide a morphological functional model of these early walkers. With the robot, we were able to simplify out all of the complexity of the mudskipper and really understand physical mechanisms uh, behind what was happening. And finally, we also had a mathematical model and using those simulations, we were really able to understand the physics behind what was going on. The team found that the mudskipper fish uses its limbs and tail to propel itself forward. What we saw the mudskippers do is as this habitat slope and the granular surface became more challenging, um, they would begin to use their tail more and more. And it wasn't just using their tail in a random fashion, it was using their tail in a particular way, timed correctly with the motion of their fins. These findings can provide new insights into how vertebrates made the transition from water to land, and may also help designers create robots that can move across various terrains more efficiently.